insects you know those creepy crawly things but despite what you may have been thinking those creepy crawly things actually help us in our environment and our ecosystem like us they also have a head they have a thorax and they have an abdomen like us so the bugs insects I'm sorry are made up of three parts head thorax and abdomen and guess what the three insects we'll be talking about today are ants, ladybugs, and honeybees. Okay, now just picture this. On a sunny day, just like today, your mommy and daddy and brothers and sisters say, hmm, let's go outside to eat. We'll have a picnic in the park. Good idea. But, did you know you need to be careful because ants are stronger than you think. They can just carry your lunch away. But the good part of ants, they help aerate the soil, the soil that tends to our crops. So it helps aerate to give oxygen to the soil and helps the plant roots and spread seeds to grow the food we eat. about ants is that they can live on every continent except Antarctica. Fun fact. Hmm. Ladybugs are another insect on our planet. Surprisingly, despite its deceitful name, ladybugs aren't bugs at all. They are insects. They do have a round body and they've got black dots on their covering. They do have antenna and six small little legs. Six small legs. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hmm. Ladybugs are beneficial because they help get rid of all the pests that infect and damage our crops that we eat. Are you a busy bee like me? I bet you are. Another animal in our community is called a honeybee. Hmm. And they are usually yellow and black. So the yellow and black stripes are the worker bees. Did you know the queen bee is bigger than the rest of the bees? And it's usually one solid color. She bosses everyone around, but that's okay because everybody has their role to play. <sighs> and not only do bees, they get the pollen and help pollinate the flowers and they help trees. They also are good because they produce the honey and the candle wax that we, and the wax to make candles. Look, got something for you. These are two products of bees honey that we eat in our food like on toast or our tea or crackers and also they make candles see the wax from honeybees mmm they make our houses smell wonderful okay but did you know if bees are feeling threatened 
they will sting you as a matter of defense. That's the way they defend themselves if they feel threatened. Ooh, ouch! But if you got stung, what would you do? <gasps> Go tell your mommy and daddy, because they're there to help. And we learned about ladybugs and we learned about honeybees but all insects need to be very very careful do you know why because silly frogs eat insects mm -hmm. yummy Oh dear! 